So in this video, I'm going to demonstrate the raft feature that the DaVinci 3D printer does. Uh, this is what it looks like when you print on a raft. So here's a few seconds of it actually printing. So the raft feature basically looks very similar to the support structure that I have in my other video. You can click here if you want to see it. Um, it's basically the, almost the same except there's just a thin layer in the bottom. Um, and now I'm going to remove it. To begin removing these I'm going to just start to pull some of the stuff off first and just break it off so that's not too bad. Um, didn't mention that these prints uh, I got from again Thingiverse. Um, just something, uh, this one's supposed to be a tripod, a small tripod and I'll assemble, I'll assemble it and do a video review of it separately. And this is a potato, uh, I guess it's like a clip for potato chips or some kind of bag. Um, thought it was a nifty thing to print, so. So, so far it comes off fairly easy. I mean, for these parts, I didn't really need a raft. I just wanted to see how it will look with a raft. But for the most part, right off with the exception that they have a rigid service here but I mean so now that I took most of it off I'm gonna have to use a little blade to cut through some of this stuff to just free it up from it So I wouldn't really recommend using the raft feature unless you really have to for some reason um, because it doesn't really come off very well on the, the actual surface. It seems like they used it too thick to where, it, I mean it came off nicely on the edges but then you swear you, where you have a surface it's, you, you basically have to sand it down and cut it off to get, to remove it. So I would only use it if you really need to. I wouldn't just print stuff on raft. Plus, it's that extra material you're wasting. But so this is what it looks kind of clean. Um, well, thanks for watching, and let me know what you think. Mm -hmm.